Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes. We're back with another one, guys. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, watch out for spam, WhatsApp, and the comment down below. Join VIP if you'd like to do so. Get your free stock from Robinhood and Webull. So let's go ahead and take a look at it, guys. So ticker symbol C O S M Cosmos holding. So as we know, this is a penny stock that's been hot recently lately. A lot of people has been jumping on the bandwagon. A lot of people has been trading it. A lot of people, some people, is even infatuated and willing to stay. And thinking it's going to be the next big thing, the next Apple, the next Microsoft, or the next Nike. Because that's how delusional some people get with these penny stocks, right? We know this. But I'm here to save you guys and warn you. Never fall in love. Treat all these stocks like hoes. Hoes that you found off the street that don't care nothing about you. If you got you jammed up, she wouldn't come visit you. She ain't going to come pay your bills. That's how you got to treat these stocks. They don't give a shit about you. Same thing, you know, with these influencers. You get what I'm saying? Even myself. You know, I care about you. I love you to death. But at the same time, you got to know people don't give a shit. And the stock market don't give a shit. So let's go ahead and take a look at it, guys. So, you know, I'm just here to keep it real with you because I love y'all. But the thing is, let's go ahead and take a look at uh, Cosmos, though, and not hold you up. So we see that Cosmos ended today at 42 cents, guys, after tanking from the 60s. I told you guys in the previous videos, you want to get in, you want to get out with these type of plays. You do not want to fall in love with them. So let me go ahead and look at the chart as we, well, I already looked at it, but I just need to see exactly where it fell from this morning. It opened up at 56. We hit a low of 36 and a high was 63. So if we go ahead and take a look at it, guys, we know this, this bad boy have ran up and hit a high of around 81 cents on November the 29th. And then it plummeted, coming down to 55 cents. And then it started to tank again, coming all the way down to 36 cents on today, right? And if you take a look at it, I got it all on the graph. I got it out for you guys so you can see, get a visualization of what's going on. See, right here we hit the low of 36 cents. Right there, got it marked in blue. Then if we go back on the wheat chart, right? If I take you back on the wheat chart, man, that jumped crazy. That's why I hate it. I hate doing screenshots because it don't be what it did do. If I go back on the wheat chart right here, you see 36 cent. That same, I, it's supposed to be a line drawn all the way through. Make that line go all the way through with your visualization. So 36 cents. We come back all the way down to last week, pivot to that support area. And you see we got all that room to bounce back up. That's a key support area, that 36. And you see how towards the end of the day, it did start to bounce. It ended at 42 after coming down to 36. That was a nice little move for this penny stock being for the fact that it happened in the after hours. So if it holds above this 36, holds above that 36 level, and now that it's at 42, I like where it ended it at because if I take you to the three-month chart, you see right there. That's this. That was its peak three months ago. It was 42. That's what it had a hard time breaking through, right? And now it's showing sustainability and holding up at that 42. That's not me trying to uh, say this is a good quality stock to be holding now, anything like that. I'm just showing you the facts. It's actually holding up at its three months high, where it was uh, having a hard time getting through 42. Now we see it's treating that as a form of support right there. And it ain't nothing but, and, it, and you see if it fall under that 42, look at all that room down there at the bottom. Look at all that space down there to fall. So if it fall below that 36 cents, I'll be exiting and running because it's going to fall even lower. And once it continues to fall, you'll probably be like, well, there's so much room to pop back more. It'll just stall out and not do really much, much of nothing. So if it holds above this key level, though, that's going to give it more, uh, it's going to give it more uh, more of a chance to explode and go possibly revisit the high or even if it don't revisit the high it could at least get back to around 60 cents right so that's how i will play it guys and right now is the ideal buy-in zone buy-in price if you're buying at 39 cents 40 cents 41 42 and i would treat 36 as a level of support if it fall below 36 i will sell everything forget about it it is what it is. Wash my hands. Go on to the next play, which you already should have done. So if you already made money on this, but I'm just updating the people and letting you guys know for the ones that still in it. But if you would like to ride it back up and take advantage of the meat of the move, because it could pop back to the 50, 60s, you will buy in at these prices and sell near your next resistance, which would be around. Let me give you guys that coordinate. That next resistance would be around. 
actually 46 cents. So if it's at 42, it's going to have another resistance around 46. If it popped through 46, it is going to go to 53. So 46 to 53, if you got in, would be the ideal sell point because it's going to, you know, sell off once it hit that point, in my opinion. Or depending on the volume and how much, how many people gobble up those cheap uh, shares, depending on the volume, how is the volume increase and the price action, it could possibly, you know, spring and go off and create a new high. But I'm not counting on that, guys. I'm not betting on that. Like I told you guys, that's too much brain power to even thinking that far for these penny stocks. I take advantage of the middle of the move, get in, get out. Keep it simple. Buy support, sell that resistance. I love you guys. We out. Add me on Instagram at the Behave Show. Get your free stock. Get in VIP, and we go.